everyone um, and welcome back to the acne channel. My name is Leah or at Skin with Leah on Instagram. Side note, come and hang out with me over there because you know, we talk all things skin positivity and self-love and confidence and all that kind of fun stuff. And I'll also do giveaways over there um, once a month or maybe more, who knows. Um, so definitely go check that out. Uh, anyway, what I want to talk to you about today is how acne and how scarring has affected my life, my mental health, my emotional well-being, all that kind of fun stuff because as you can see, I'm not wearing makeup right now and this is the situation and I've also been breaking out um, the last couple of days. I've been randomly breaking out, um, which I think is because I eat too much sugar. Uh, so <laughs> um, anyway, I want to talk to you today about basically all kind of different ways that acne and scarring has affected my life negatively and also positively because there are positive things about acne, believe it or not, but I have found a lot of um, blessings in my acne journey and, you know, as well as some not so great stuff. So I want to share all that with you today just to let you know, like, this is normal. You're, you're normal if you feel um, like you're alone with the, these struggles or you feel like you don't really know um how to you know find positive in acne and in your journey this is definitely the video for you and yeah let's jump right into it okay so the first thing i want to talk about today is overcoming struggle so when i first started breaking out about when was that like two years ago it was rough like let me tell you that it was really rough for me because i i mean my skin was never like super clear but all of a sudden i got like acne all over my cheeks which I, before that I also never had any pimples on my cheeks when I would get like breakouts I would get them usually on my jaw and my chin and then all of a sudden like my cheeks were just covered um, so what happened was I went off birth control pill and that's kind of when my acne came about and then it was really tough in the beginning like I didn't want to leave my house I didn't even want my roommate to see me without makeup on I remember one time I was staying over at my parents' house and I would put on foundation in the morning to go downstairs for breakfast. And I never wanted anyone to see me without makeup on and I was so ashamed and I would go to the gym. Like I would, in the morning, put on a full face of makeup just to go to the gym and then I would come home and take it off and like spend the rest of my day in my room. And it was just really, really tough for a long time. It took me, up until I want to say like August of last year that's when I kind of started to accept my skin more so that's what people don't understand like people who don't have acne don't understand how big of an impact it can have on your mental health because it's not just like it's it's more than just your skin because you get all these stares you get people commenting you get people like giving you advice and that was just something that I struggled a lot with um, that's why I never wanted to leave my house without makeup on because I was like, everyone's gonna stare at me. Everyone's gonna think I'm dirty. Like having acne really, it kind of put me in this place of I'm not good enough. Like I'm ugly, I'm gross, I'm not worthy. And I'm sure like if you struggle with acne and or like any kind of skin situation, I'm sure you can relate because it's an insecurity that you can't really hide. Like it's always there. Yes, you can put on makeup, but we all know like when you have acne and you put on coverage you can still see like the bumps are still there or the hyperpigmentation still shines shines through like it doesn't shine but like it still shows or like scarring like dented scar like pitted scars you can still see like the texture and everything and it can make you like feel so unworthy because everyone around you doesn't have acne and there you are and you just think oh my god like I can't like I'm gonna compare myself to everyone like if I go out with my friends like everyone's gonna like compare my skin to their skin and it just it's it was a long journey for me and it has acne having acne has affected me negatively in a lot of ways like i said like i didn't leave my house i didn't want my parents even to see me without makeup on i would hide away i would like spend hours and hours in front of the mirror putting myself down and like telling myself how big of like you're a monster you look disgusting all these things like i didn't want to i didn't want to see people 
it was really, really rough. And then, but, here comes the big butt. Here, the, <laughs> wow, okay, um, here comes the butt. Like, not the booty, but the, anyway. Um, the other side, I guess, is the positive side. And having acne has also impacted my life in a positive way. So, I started sharing my journey on Instagram in August. And that's kind of also when I started to accept my skin and love myself and embrace embrace it all. And what I did was I just decided, okay, here's the weekend and I'm not gonna wear makeup the whole entire weekend. And that's kind of where it started. And that was like a breakthrough moment for me. And that moment, that weekend was the change, like the, it was the turning point because that's when I started to see all the blessings kind of, right? That's when I started to think, okay, sure I have acne, but like what's the good in it, right? And that's also something that you can do. Like when you feel like having acne like only gives you all the negative, there's only negative, only negative, that's not true. Um, a, because there's always something positive, there's always a lesson to learn, like no matter how, like, how much shit hits the fan, there's always a positive um, for you to learn. And, and, and when it comes to acne, for me, that was just being more gentle with myself. I learned how to do that. I learned how to not attach my worth to my appearance. I learned that um, how to not compare myself to other people. I learned to be more compassionate towards myself and others. Like there's so many great lessons that acne has given me. There's so many blessings that I that I got from it because yes it was horrible yes it made me feel like I was not worthy it made me feel ugly but also it kind of gave me my mental strength like it gave me it gave me my self-love because also like while I was on birth control I suffered from depression like caused by my birth control and so getting acne and now looking back I can see that but you know during that time it was a little harder but now looking back I will take acne and breakouts and, and the skin I have now over depression any day any day anywhere like no matter what I will take that over depression and that was also like that's also why getting acne for me was such a big blessing and and that's also why it has impacted me in such a positive ways because I was able to get out of my depression. I was able to get out of my anxiety. And acne was just kind of the, I don't know, it just kind of came along with it, but I, I was able to accept it as a positive thing because, okay, I have acne, but guess what? I'm not depressed anymore. And that's why it was, it, it it's like, I'm a different person now because of it. Like, because I had acne, because I have now my scarring, I'm a different person. And like I said, I'm more compassionate and I am able to look at life with a more like positive attitude and I'm able to kind of see, see the good in everything. Like now I see the good in my skin because now I have created this community of people. I can inspire people. I can help people. I can show people, hey, you can be confident. You can love yourself. You can, you can, um, I don't know, just embrace who you are even when you have acne, even when you have scarring. And I just have this group of people now around me. I have my banished family now. Like I'm a banished warrior now, which is so amazing. And now I'm able to just impact other people's lives in a positive way and that's why it's so worth it and that's why acne yes it has affected me negatively but the positive outweigh the negative like tenfold 100 percent and now you know now i'm i'm doing this and now i can share my journey and now i can do giveaways with banish and now i can i don't know just like help others i can i can help others through their struggles the way I helped myself through my struggles right and you know now I'm just over here making videos and and talking about fading my acne scars like now I can help others you know with their with their acne fading journey like I don't I don't really know a lot about how to cure acne but now through Banish, I know a lot about fading your acne scars and I can just help others get that confidence back with, you know, fading your scars um, and also like with your mindset because they both go together, 
right? That's just kind of my message. That's always been my message that yes, clear skin, fanning your scars is the goal and I'm working towards that and that's why I'm also working with Banish like that's why I'm doing this but there's no point in hating yourself until you get there like there's no point in letting your skin dictate your entire mood and life and your level of self-love and your level of confidence there's no point in that that's so that's kind of my message um but yeah I've been random rambling this is a very rambly video this is kind of like I don't know, I just sat down and talked basically, that's what I do. Um, but yeah, I hope you enjoyed this. I hope that you know that you're not alone and you're not you're not alone. We're all here, we're, we're all um, here for you. And if you let acne um, be a positive thing for you, if you choose to look at it this way um, versus, you know, only seeing the negative, your life will change basically the way mine did um so i really encourage you to try to focus on the positive that acne is giving you or like the pos whatever it may be maybe it's just like oh i discovered this really great skincare line right oh i discovered like banish products they help me fade my scars now that's a positive right i encourage you to always focus on the positive and also let me know what you think. Let me know if this was helpful for you down below. I love reading the comments always. Come on over to my Instagram and hang out with me over there. It's at Skin with Leah. It's going to be linked down below as well, as always. And I hope you have an amazing rest of the day, week, uh, night, whatever time it is in your country right now. And I will see you in the next video. Bye, guys. Mwah.